Okay, now I'm going to do the coupling movement. Question number four, A major. So first of all, I make sure my wheels are chalk. There is no gap between the fifth wheel and the upper plate. No cracks, no damages on the fifth wheel. No cracks, no damages on the frame. My lever, it's in lock position. My jaws are locked. Then I go other side and say the same thing. I need to go in the truck. I'm going to start my truck. I just push the yellow brake in. I'm going to put in a drive. So I'm going to give the gas pedal as I move a little bit forward, right way I put on the brake. Put the truck in neutral. I go outside. I'm going to take a chalk. This one. I'm going to mark it right here. We are marking it to mark like this. Then I'm going in the truck again. I'm going to release the brake again. Put the truck in reverse. I'm going to give the gas. As the truck moves a little bit, right away I pull out the brake. Put the truck in neutral. So now I'm going to see there's movement or not. So there is no coupling movement, which is good. If the coupler is insecure or movement exceeds prescribed limit, which is half an inch, that's a major defect. I'm going to call my owner, write in the logbook, I cannot drive. 